he was uh, Dewberry showed me all the uh, Instagram messages he was receiving from uh, now man Kivo's team. He was hey, um, that, hey, listen. That was a little listen, listen, listen. I was having a, I was having uh, I was on my, I was having downtime and pimping. Cause I was trying to straddle the fence. I was trying to go to college and pimp at the same time. <laughs> you can't do that. Shit. So the forces wouldn't let me knock off. Okay, nigga, I'm going to go get my partner D Lo fifty thousand dollar diamond watch. Uh, I'm playing parlay tickets every night, trying to hit to go have me some campaign money. Uh, why knock a white? Why ain't been able to get a bitch in about two, three months? Why get a white bitch up out of bucks one night? <laughs> All me and the white get in the back seat. This nigga hurt right. And this what I think why they fing with Dewberry. Boy, me and the get in the back seat. Boy, she saying, Oh, I want that nigga. Oh, I want that. And boy, she grabbing on that. And that said, Oh, I want 12 inches. I raise up and hit the window. Boom, 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 boom. Drew, baby, I need some help. I ain't got no more 12 inches. We go out to flip you. Yeah, 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 yeah. We go out to flip the. So, <laughs> Who better get back here with the God damn that shit, man. I ain't got what she need, man. I ain't got no more 12 inches, man. That's crazy. I don't know what this nigga got. I just know I dropped them off and go home by myself saying damn. <laughs> I get mad and text Newberry and tell him, say, man, take a picture of the bitch ID to front and back so we can steal a credit card and nothing. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I'm feeling rejection. I'm riding home feeling like daddy didn't come pick me up. Yeah, they're feeling the rejection. Yeah, yeah, no, nah, man. So I tell that story on stage one day. Maybe they trying to drop me off and chill. I don't know what these niggas doing, man, because they really harassing this nigga by his I saw that. That was crazy. See it crane. I saw that. that was and these big, oh, and listen, I mean, these supposed to be big money niggas. Big money niggas. Texting every day like a. With, 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 with seven, eight business and home. They these big money industry niggas. They know Lil Durk and these are industry niggas. Why they got their attention on the. Boy, that conversation ruled the nation. Boy, I'm a Mackin motherfucker. I told these niggas, I told these nigga my first Say Cheese TV interview. Say, man, don't y'all fall for this conversation in the Mackin because it was really designated for the bros. But then, nigga, my nigga come along and say, it's for the little boys, too, if they listen. <laughs> it's, for, it's for the little boys, too, if they listen. So these niggas listening because they ain't got no business listening. So, yeah, nigga, I'm getting it to them, boy, and I'm serving it on a raw platter, too, boy. Dang. Conversation rules the nation. Hey, and, and and your fans are enjoying it, man. Nigga, we here too. And I, and, and, God damn right we're enjoying it. <laughs>